Hello, welcome back. We are going to dye the pot leaf, marijuana leaf that we folded in a previous section of the videos. Um, again, this is a green leaf with a rainbow color scheme. And so I've got all those colors laid out here in bottles. And we'll start by dyeing the leaf itself. We'll dye right along that string line there. There's, that's our line that we drew when we folded it, and then also the string will die right up to that, uh, that string line there. Again, that, that will be green. So here is my green. And I'm going to start out at the edge so I can get control of the flow of the die before I get too far in. This is a two-sided pattern, therefore this fold right here is pretty darn thick. So we want to make sure that we get dye all the way through the leaves. Again, I had drawn a little pink line inside here to make sure that I got enough dye in there because I had a problem before with that little, just that little area staying white on me. We'll flip it over, dye the other side almost to the line there and then from there I take my fingers and I sandwich them together and I just kind of squeeze this a little bit I don't want to squeeze too hard and chance it coming unfolded so you want to be real careful with how hard you squeeze it if you look like it's starting to unfold on you then stop so just squeeze that and I do that to try to get that make sure that the dye penetrates all the way through the many layers of fabric here. Okay. So there's that. It is done. I'll rinse my fingers off. And now we will bottle dye the rest of the shirt in that rainbow color scheme. We'll start by putting this in a bin. So we'll start out our rainbow color scheme. I always start with yellow. Generally it looks good up against whatever pattern you've got going on. So I take my squeeze bottle and I come back a good probably two inches or so with that first line because I don't want the yellow to run into the green and make that a different color. So I just come across there again. This is pretty thick through here. So I want to put that on pretty heavy. Next orange red I gotta tighten that lid I use a small line of turquoise just kind of right on the red to get some purple and then also another blue just a royal blue for my regular blue and then green okay and you'll repeat the colors till you get to the end of the shirt wherever that stops on whatever color We'll be able to get a little red here. Probably some turquoise there on the end. And that'll be it. Alright. Now we'll flip the shirt over. And we'll put those same colors in the same places for a uniform striping of rainbow and on when I flip it I just do all of my yellows all of my oranges all of my reds because you can see where the color is coming through so you know where to put the dye start setting those off Thin line of 
turquoise. Blue. And finally the green. Alright, there it is. The dyed pot leaf, marijuana leaf. We'll throw a lid on this bin to keep that shirt moist, keep it from drying out. We'll let it set approximately 12 hours. We'll hand rinse it and then wash dry it and have a look and see what we end up with. All right, here's our final product on the pot leaf shirt. It's dyed, washed, dried, laid out. Everything looks good. The leaf looks good. The colors look good. Again, this is a front and back pattern. We got good fill on the leaf, so I'm pretty happy about that. I really love the way this turned out. Appreciate you watching the video.